here, it's Pilates day. Yes, I'm going to give you some great abdominal work, a little bit of glute work with our lovely boss. Any kind of ball really, as long as it's squishy and it's not slippy, so you can actually, so it doesn't slip away from you. And a little bit more sticky and about this size is pretty good, but it needs to have some uh, squish in it. So don't blow it all the way up. Keep some squishiness in it so you can squeeze it with your muscles. All right, so girl, grab your ball and let's get going. So first of all, we're gonna to turn to our side and we're gonna place the ball just in between your shoulder blades, right in your mid thoracic spine. And we're gonna roll down onto the ball. So you can feel it in the middle of your shoulder blades. Now place the inner thighs together, heels together. And you're gonna reach your hands forwards and place the hands as you interlace the hands behind the head. So you're in this position. Now, drop your tailbone down, lift up and look towards your pubic bone here. And then we're just gonna take a deep breath, inhale as we go up and over the ball. And then exhale and come back. Inhale over, so you're breathing, and then exhale in, lifting up. So we're gonna continue doing this, squeezing the inner thighs together, and keep the elbows nice and wide, and the hands are supporting the head, neck, and shoulders as you lift up. Okay, so we're gonna lift up and then down. Exhale, lift up, shh. inhale and come down. Let's do four more like that, four, shh. and down. Exhale, three, shh. and down. Just give me two more, shh. last time, shh. and hold it there, and then come all the way back. Hold this position here, feels really nice. Now we're gonna add a single leg knee. So we lift up, single knee, and then down. So look at the shin is parallel to the sky. And in and down. Exhale. Last time, hold it here. Lift that leg up as much as you can. Flex and point, flex and point, flex and point, flex and point. Bend the knee, bring it down, lift your head back again. Now, we're gonna go with the other side. Shin is parallel to the sky, and we exhale and inhale. Be mindful to lift up with your abs and not yank on your head with your hands. Your abs are flexing the spine. Let's just do a few more. Exhale up, inhale down. And then one more, hold it here, lift that leg up. Feels good, flex and point, flex and point, flex and point, flex and point, hold it there. Bend the knees, inner thighs together, reach forwards. And we're just gonna do a little pulsing as if you're reaching towards your knees and you're drawing in the navel as much as you can. So even though I'm reaching, I'm scooping out through those abs as much as I can. Four, three, two, take your right hand on top of your left hand and we do the hula girl. So you go right then left, we call this the hula girl. Right and left. Keep breathing. Four, and three, and two, and one. Hold it there, take the hands back behind the head, extend those legs, come all the way back, and just enjoy that stretch. You can either have your elbows bent or you can extend them out. And just hold that stretch, reach the hands over your head, and we're gonna roll ourselves up, grab the ball, reach forwards, and now we're gonna roll down to where you feel those abs contract, and then roll back up and extend. And again, we're gonna roll down, and then lift up, and extend. And then roll down, lift up. Now we're gonna add the knees. We're gonna roll down, bend your knees, and lift. 
Rolling down to where you feel those abs contract. Bend the knees, lift up. And then roll down, C curve, let us see with the spine. Roll all the way up. And again, just a couple more, rolling down. And bend, and again, rolling down. Bend, one more, we're gonna hold that C, let us see position. Hold it here, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Reach forward, and then we're gonna roll down all the way back, up over your head, and enjoy that stretch. And now we're gonna slowly roll back up again. Roll up, and release, nice and tall. Now we're gonna come around, and we come onto a quadruped position. So this is called all fours position, okay? So you're here, place your hands like this, grab the ball, squeeze that ball, take the hands forwards, and then lift the leg up. So you're squeezing that ball, and we're just gonna lift the leg up and down. So now we're going into your glute work and your hamstrings, but guess what? Your abs are stabilizing too. So it's not just about your glutes and your hamstrings, your upper body, you're pushing away, dropping your scapula down. So you're getting those nice glute work. Hold it here, hold. Bring the knee in and we're just gonna take it to the side. Very simple, basic exercises, but the best exercises that you can pick up and do at any time that get results. Okay, out and in. If you feel you wanna work a little bit harder, just wrap it up, give more reps. But squeeze that ball. Four, and three, and two, and one. Hold it there. Now we're gonna bring it forwards and back. Forwards and back. You can see I'm forwards and back. Forwards and back. Forwards and back. Couple more. And then hold it here, hold. Lift up in that little attitude here. Good, three, two, and hold it there. And then come down, stretch back. If you drop the ball, don't worry, pick it back up again. There was a second then that I thought I'd drop the ball, but it was still there. <laughs> so don't worry about it. If you drop the ball, pick it back up again and start again. It's a lot of hamstring strength that you need for this. So you are gonna drop the ball sometimes, but that's okay, you pick it back up again and you go again. Hands here, underneath your shoulders, push away, depress your scapula, and lift that leg up. Scoop out those abs, so you're pressing those abs against your spine, and we're gonna lift. So here we go, upper body is stabilizing, you're gonna feel your back, feel your lats, right here, and you're balancing, your glutes and your hamstrings are working, but your abs, you're keeping your pelvis still, okay? Just keep it there. We can do eight to 16 reps, however you want to do it. Four, three, two, and one. Bring it down. Now we're going to take it lateral to the side, to the side. Keep squeezing that ball. Okay? Now don't forget your upper body though. We all forget. We all like start doing this and we think that it just matters about your booty and your legs. No, it doesn't. Your upper body is working really hard right now. So it's total body when done correctly, right? Just total body. All right, let's just do a few more. Couple more. I'm not very good at counting. Hold it here, hold. Now we're gonna go forwards and back. Forwards and back. Keep squeezing onto that ball. This is when you're probably gonna try and drop the ball now, as I thought I was. And keep going. Now last one. Hold it here, little attitude. So you can see I've got my little attitude going on here, squeezing the hamstring, scooping out those abs, breathing. Let's just do a few more. And then hold it there. And then come back down, stretch back. So to make it harder, just add more reps. Make it easier, less reps. Pretty easy in your routine. Take your ball. And from here, you're going to put your ball just forwards out the way. And we're going to do some easy peasy 
um, forearm plank. So you're in this position, but get your setup correctly first. Shoulder blades down, elbows underneath your shoulders. And I'm just gonna walk my hands forwards and I'm gonna lift up into a little pike here with my knees bent. And I'm gonna try and walk my legs back and then press the pelvis forwards. So we're in that lovely position here, push away. And I'm gonna rock forwards and back. Rock forwards and back. Rocking forwards and back. So I'm stabilizing with the core and I'm just rocking forwards on my shoulders. Okay, rocking forwards. One more, hold it there. Drop the knees down, keep active. My abs are still actively working. My elbows are pressing down and my upper body is stabilizing and working really hard. All right, you ready? One more time, you're gonna lift up. Hold it down, try and lift that right leg up, up and down. And then switch, up and down. And then hold it there, four, three, two and one. Coming in, all forwards, child's pose. Hold that child's pose. And then slowly roll yourself all the way up. Finish up with a nice little stretch. You're gonna take one leg across, stretch. And then the other leg. It's a simple workout, but there's a lot of challenge there. As long as you're doing the exercises correctly, and you're thinking about the perfect form, setting yourself up with your upper body, really exhaling and using your core as you lift up, any basic exercises become really challenging when you really put your mind to your body. That changes the whole game of working your abdominals, working your glutes, working total body, when you really focus your mind-body connection. I hope you're enjoying it. Love to see you again. Remember, subscribe below and uh, comments below. Love to hear from you, what you would like to see more of. Other than that, have a great day. Tracy Mallet. Bye.